All right, what's going on, man? I am Michael Lee, okay? And I want to... And this is my second time doing this video because first time coming with a lot of YouTube. And so I did Facebook. So, this is how it is. <clears throat> um, anyway, I want to show you all how to do a uh, music cover art because it's kind of it's kind of scary out there, you know? I kind of want to show you all how, how I do it and... You know, uh, even though this is a retail business plans or YouTube channel, uh, you know, music, I mean, art is retail. So, you know, like, why not? So, okay, let's get into it. You'll need two things. And I'm doing this on my iPhone. However, this would be, um, you can do it on your computer. However, it's like more... Faster. It's more faster if you do it on the, um, it's more efficient or proficient if you do it on your, on your phone, your iPhone. So let's get into it. So you're going to need two things, two programs, two apps. One is documents and the second one is Canva. Okay. And so, documents and Canva. Canva and documents. So, let's get started, shall we? Um, I shouldn't have did this er, this early because I haven't logged in yet. I just downloaded it. Um, so, I need to log in because I already do have a Canva. And I'm doing logging in with my Facebook, my, what you would call my Google email. All right, cool. Now, <clears throat> we have song cover art here. Okay. And let's see. I would like to do, yeah, let's do this one. I don't know, let's do this one. Yeah, yeah, this one right here. Let's try this one right here. And then click it and then access all photos. Yep. And then that one right there. I don't want that. I don't want that. And so I want to delete that. Now I want my... I'm going to want this, so... I want to do... Let's just do, like... New music first. New... Music... M U S uh new music and then when I'm gonna put first first for you all right cool now I kinda like how it is All right, now, if you didn't like how it was centered or if you wanted to kind of play around with how it was, like, the positioning of the words, you could do, you kind of move it around with your finger. I'll just say it like that. But then again, uh, 
right around here. It's good enough because I don't know the height. I don't want to get cut off or nothing when you put it on line or height. You're going to have my, my preferably done. So now you do download. And I want to download as draft. Now I'm using the free version of Canva, but you don't have to. You can use the paid version. All right. And it says try our most loved tools, not now. Uh, go to home page. And these are all the things that I have done so far off of Canva. And that's my newest one. So, go back, right? And make sure it's in my photo. Now, just to make sure everything is copacetic, what I want to do is go into documents, push OK, next, next, next. In case I get kind of disconnected, I just want to do a PDF to JPEG conversion. So next, that's basically what we're doing here. And then exit. No, they're not going to pay for it. Because I don't really use documents that much that I want to pay you for. But if you use it a lot, then you can pay for it. And it's definitely worth it. So, no, it's not right there, not right there, not right there. But keep going. All right, now push the right the edit icon on search P D F to JPEG, and meaning it's just going from words to to picture. All right. So, we want to convert PDF to it. From device. All right. PDF to JPEG. And I think we're okay. Because we're not showing up. Because if it was showing up, that me. Let me try this one time. I think we're okay because it's downloaded to the images. It transferred. So, I don't think we need to. Yeah. It's good. You see how it appeared right there? And it's not. You can't select it. That means it's already transferred. So, that's, that's all you really need when it comes to the phone. However, if you are doing this and it's on the computer, what you need to do is that extra step. And you will need to convert it from PDF to JPEG. But because this is on computer, I mean, because this is on my phone, it did it for you. And so you are good, but good to go. So thank you all for watching. And so this right here is my new album art for your cover, for your song, your single, or for your album. You can do whatever you want or need to. I already saved it. So it's saved and you can put it on your Dropbox or you promote it on Facebook or 
your YouTube or your Instagram or how you want to. I'm not going to, like, do it because, you know, I mean, because this is not for me, but it's just a sample. But it is what it is. Thank y'all and have a great day.